Hello, tap try here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to save a file with a transparent background in Adobe InDesign. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So as you can see, I've just created a new InDesign document and created this design with this object right here. And let's say that if we want to save this as a transparent background, we can actually do that really simple. So the first thing you want to do when we are ready to save our file is to go up to the top bar and choose file and then go down to export. You can also use the keyboard shortcut control E and this will now open. From here you want to find a place on your computer where we would like to save our file. So I've just found a folder right here. And the first thing you want to do is to just give it a file name. So I'll just call this leaf transparent background. Next we want to go down to the file type right here. And as you can see it is right now set to Adobe PDF. So we want to change this to PNG. So we can save this as a transparent background. So we want to just select the PNG option right here. And then just press save. And this export PNG panel will now show up. The first options right here can be used to select what pages you would like to export. So let's say that you had multiple pages. You could either select them all or range between them. In this example, we only have this one page with this object right here. So I'll just be choosing all. And the same if you had spreads, you could also choose that. Then if we just go down right here to the image, we can change the quality of our file and the same with the resolution and the color space. But what is really important and what we want to make sure is that down in the options right here, that we have checked this on, which is the transparent background. And if you don't do this, there will be a background on your file. So just click right here to choose the transparent background, and then you can just press export. And the file will just export. And if we now go into our folder where we have saved our file, we can see that we have it right here, and it is now transparent. And we can just test this by just importing it into our InDesign document. So if I just take the transparent image we have just saved and drag it into the document, we can see that it is now transparent. So yeah, that is actually how to save a file with a transparent background in Adobe InDesign. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. That was all for now. See you in the next one.